And CNN News 18 gets you the exclusive details here. This pertains to the Enforcement Directorate's charge sheet against former Delhi Deputy Chief Minister Manish Sisodia in the Liquor Gates camp. As per this charge sheet, Mr. Sisodia changed the cabinet note to exclude legal expert opinions. Allegedly, Mr. Sisodia got old cabinet notes destroyed so that there is no evidence which is left. The Enforcement Directorate also sees that Hawala channels were used and the money was diverted to AAP's Goa election campaign. These are allegations that were asserted by the agency when the investigation was underway, and now they have been said in that chart sheet as well. Ananya, the key takeaways. Well, definitely, this is an explosive chart sheet that has been filed by the Enforcement Directorate. Now, a cognizance has been taken over this particular chart sheet, and CNN News 18 has exclusively access details uh, for its viewers from this particular chart sheet. Now, the first thing is that, you know, he destroyed the old cabinet note, uh, which actually pertained to, you know, the legal opinions given by three major legal experts. And remember that these are not general or ordinary people. These were uh, former Chief Justice of India, Dr. Ranjan Gogoi. It was also including, uh, in fact, the legal opinion from Mr. Mukul Ruhadgi, who was the senior advocate. But all of these uh, opinions were ignored. And remember that these opinions said that, you know, the old policy, the old liquor policy, the old excise policy should continue in the national capital territory of Delhi. Now, the second big revolution that has come out is that AAP's top leader, Durgesh Pathak, had, in fact, asked one of the AAP workers, Mahinder Chaudhary, to stay uh, with Vijay Nair uh, after he, um, Vijay Nair had returned in 2022 uh, to India. In fact, it was also mentioned that uh, there is a voice recording that the Enforcement Directorate has enclosed in its charge sheet, clearly mentioning where uh, uh, Mahinder Chaudhary is suggesting on behest of Durgesh Pathak to Vijay Nair that, you know, there is some kind of tru truths that should not be revealed to the agencies, basically tutoring Vijay Nair to give certain kind of statements to conceal certain facts in this particular yeah. case. Another uh, big charge that the Enforcement Directorate is that the Vijay Nair and Amit Arora, remember Vijay Nair is said to be one of the close associates of the Amadmi Party leaders including Manish Sisodhya and Kejival and he along with Amit Arora, arm twisted liquor dealers in Punjab in order to give up their liquor licenses and in exchange of that uh, these licenses were given to two companies which actually gave kickbacks to Manish Sisodhya, uh, in fact, uh, uh, to uh, Vijay yes. Nair and other people. The, the yes. South Lobby too uh, was favoured in this particular policy. Another big charge that comes up is that Vijay Nair's criminal activities were, uh, in fact, you know, uh, supported by Manish Sisodhya and Hawala channels were used to fund the Goa election campaigns. There are notes uh, that have been recovered of 20 and 50 rupees. Uh, hmm. Pictures of those notes have been enclosed in that particular charge sheet, clearly mentioning that these notes were particularly used for Hawala transactions and this Hawala money was basically used Ananya, for advertisement the, in the Goa election. Through. These, are, these yeah. are allegations, as you, as you point out, that have existed and they, are be, they have been reiterated in this charge sheet, the exclusive details that my colleague is reporting. But the primary job for the Enforcement Directorate is to create the trail of money. They look after a certain kind of offences and for those kind of offences and to secure a conviction, it is important for the agency to not just have the proceeds of crime, say the money which is recovered, which is not the, not the scenario in this case, but to be able to establish the money trail as to through what channels did it go, where exactly is the money right now, what happened to it. As far as this chart sheet is concerned, does it say anything on the money trail? Because that's the core case for the Enforcement Directorate and the rest of the other facets, say misuse of public office, whether there were you know, any kind of uh, destruction of evidence, all of that will be looked after by the Central Bureau of Investigation. Ananya. Well, uh, definitely, you know, uh, Anusha, there are, uh, you know, scripts and tables that have been given out by the Enforcement Directorate clearly establishing the money trail, how the money travelled from the South Group through Vijay Nair and other people and how uh, liquor licences were given and money trail shows how that particular money went into Goa elections and uh, went to various people and, uh, and, and definitely the Enforcement Directorate has given out clear charts to show how the money has travelled, how this untainted money has actually travelled through people, whether it was from uh, the profit margins of 12%, whether it was from the kickbacks that were received from the South Group or 
whether it was from in fact you know the punjab uh, uh, people where you know punjab government machinery was basically used to uh, uh, threaten uh, certain liquor vendors to give up their licenses so that uh, the licenses would be given to other entities which in turn paid money tainted money in fact uh, 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 with regards to uh, one certain fact of this particular charge it around 8 crore rupees it has been clearly mentioned by the enforcement directorate that right. you know uh the money traveled through vijay nayar and uh, in fact manish sisodia too is a part and parcel to it because he actively supported uh, the charges of uh, in fact and, you know, ananya that uh, that particular uh, money uh, trail the, the, the and the excerpts of the money trail that you're pointing out to our viewers is the core of that chart sheet that's what the enforcement directorate needs to prove in a court of law because these are predicate offenses that the enforcement directorate really probes thank you ananya for getting us all the details on that very important story all the details first here on cnn news 18 as far as that chart sheet is concerned shifting our focus to the northeastern state of manipur amit tension